so since we've introduced better every day as a, as a method, uh, we work differently, I work differently. So rather than uh, approaching, approaching situations with answers, I now approach things, uh, situations with questions. Uh, and I spend more of my time in the work with, with the frontline staff. So historically, where I may have been making decisions in remotely in isolation, I now do so in, in collaboration with, with the team who are best placed to, to answer those questions at the front line of the work. Uh, so I spend more of my time interfacing with the team and more of my time interfacing with the customer at, at the point of, of uh, interaction, so in the work much more. We introduced the Better Every Day approach for a number of reasons, but, but primarily to put the customer back at the center of our organization. Um, over, over the, the last few years, we've been focused um, heavily on technical remediation, so very inward looking. And by adopting this method, it's, it's really refocused us and, and got us looking at our customers again, which, is, which has been great. So it shouldn't be underestimated that, you know, that the change it will have on the organization, but the commitment equally that it, that it takes from the organization to make it successful. The other thing that, that um, needs to be noted is this approach isn't about experts coming in and doing it to you. It's about experts providing you method so you can do it to yourself. And that's one of the beauties, again, of, of the approach is that, that now our engagement with state services is winding down. We've been left with the capability to continue this. So we've embedded the approach in the organization and we now have our own facilitators who can actually run method workshops with others in our organization. Uh, another key to the approach is, is to actually get to the underlying thinking and challenge the thinking. I think um, very often, and certainly we have, have actually dealt with um, symptoms that have been symptoms with the, the current system and basically tuned the current system in its widest sense. But what this method has enabled us to do is actually understand the original thinking and challenge the original thinking, which has enabled us to actually create a better system. So not improve the existing system, but actually create a new system. And that's where we've made some real step change improvements. With the new way of working, I use the go-see method. And so during trial and test, I would, I would frequently go to the team and sit with the team and, and listen to the team and how the team were interacting with the customers. And what that did was gave me a straight line of sight with our new performance measures. And I was able to see firsthand that the intervention that we made in trial and test was increasing performance from the perspective of the customer. The schools were really happy uh, and satisfied with this new way of working. And so anecdotally by listening in, but also through hard measures, we could see that the intervention we were making was making progress. I think when we embarked on this journey with state services, uh, we didn't really know where we were gonna end up. I can say, that the, the engagement has absolutely exceeded our expectations. It's had a, a, pro a profound impact on uh, the way our business is going to be organized, the way we manage as an agency, and the performance of our, of our agency. Uh, initially, we, we wanted uh, a method to uh, engage better with the customer, uh, to increase engagement, and to, to make us more effective. And this approach has certainly done all three.